We in the research department, we use AI uh, for doing simulations about future tax reforms. It was a political demand to create a new type of simulation in order to profile the winners and the losers of uh, new um, tax regulations as best as possible. Project Aurora consists of a simulation program that has all the data from all Belgian taxpayers for the personal income tax. And we can use this program to play around with it a little bit or see what happens if you, uh, would, for example, adjust its tax scale and so forth. We have uh, an impact on the taxpayers themselves, but they're also into socioeconomic groups divided. And so we can make an assessment about which kind of people are, would be impacted by a specific tax reform. The calculation of the personal tax income is something that operational is already available for a long time. Before it was always based on samples because it is that uh, difficult to calculate and in order to have um, an answer in a reasonable time, they always use samples and that's always biased. And so when you have, for example, uh, you study the abolishment of a rare tax regime and there's only a limited amount of people who are using this, well, if you use a sample, then it's very likely that the sample is not going to be representative. By rolling out this project, we had to create a digital twin. So in SAS, we created a copy of these very complex calculations with all the different um, business rules in, inside of it, which made it very, very complex um, in order to uh, roll out new demands on what is the impact of new changes in this calculation. At the end, we, we try to profile very clearly the ones who are losers and uh, winners of this type of, of changes and uh, very um, detailed impact on the treasury. And of course, that's our most valuable contribution to public policy making. Uh, so the better our estimations are, the better the policy makers are informed and the better the results will be. So that's what I like best about the model. You can have a lot of results, but you have to visualize them well, very dynamically, very easy to use for drilling down, to profile, to see which region, which class of age, which type of, of customer stakeholder is really impacted at the end. So you can make really nice dynamic reports that really allow you to convey your message. I got involved in the project Aurora once the learning needs were clear. So we are developing a community of SaaS users at FPS Finance to um, help with learn, learning questions, um, best practices can be shared. Um, and also we would like to start with a learning platform um, so our people, our employees can continue their learning online um, when and where they want. I think AI is very important for the future of uh, governance in general and certainly at the uh, Ministry of Finance and we can uh, still improve a lot in this area. I'm proud to be a witness of this public organization. I think it's also the public sector who can be a pioneer in innovation. Mm -hmm.